Hey, welcome, welcome. This is Marcus Bowles, President and CEO of Customized Minds. As always, you know I'm pumped up. I'm excited that you're back here with me. Get some more great content and information that's going to inspire and empower your life. You know we got another great topic, so let's dive straight in. Today, we're going to be talking about love what you do. And yes, it's that simple. You need to love what you do. So I asked the question, do you really understand the impact of loving what you do? How that can be negative or how that can be positive when it comes to your life? What does that really mean? Well, let me break it down this way. All right, you spend three fourths of your time on this earth in your life working, right? You spend three-fourths of your life working. Now, that does take into consideration you as a child. That does take into consideration you retired and not working and, and, and living the, the golden years, as they call it. So, But all of that time in the middle, you are doing what? Majority of the time, you are working, you are growing, and you are doing what you love? It's a question mark. You spend anywhere between 45 to 50 weeks out of the 52 weeks we have each year, compounded over 30 to 40 years of working. Are you doing what you love? You need to be doing what you love because do you really want to spend that much time doing something you hate? I mean, I'm trying to wrap my mind around when you break it down that way, 40 to 45, maybe even 50 weeks out of each year, we're only getting 52, you are working three-fourths of that time and then compound that over 30 to 40 working years and you're not doing what, you're, what you love? Now, I'm not saying just like any other relationship, you're not going to love 100% all aspects of it, but you need to be about 90 to 95% all the way on board, at least when it comes to doing what you love. That's not a, just a cliche statement. Again, I hope me putting some numbers behind it puts it in perspective that regardless of what the world may say, regardless of what the news and the media may say, oh, you're not going to find what you love, that's BX. You can do in our society today anything. And if you love it, and if you're good at it, and it's something that people want to buy, it adds value, you will get paid for it. I guarantee it. If it's something that adds value, something that you're good at, and it's a need, you will get paid for it. So there you have it. You need to find something that you love and whatever it is that you love you need to be doing it. you do not need to spend 30 to 40 years of your working life doing something that you do not love that is not benefiting you that's not benefiting me that's not benefiting the rest of the people that are around you because you are not doing what you were put here to do you are settling settling does not progress our world having super achievers like I know you are progresses our world so as I always say you have exactly what you say now if you believe it now it is yours to have the power of life and death is in the tongue more important than the mind first you gotta believe in your heart I believe in my heart you will now be focused on doing what you love that may require you to quit your job find that what you love and be doing that. Take care, share this information, and I'll see you back here on the next one.